Hey YouTube, Carlo here. Welcome to the vlog. This is the channel where we talk about sneakers and tech. And for this episode, we're all about sneaker shopping over at Commonwealth in Greenbelt. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please make sure that you do so because we are giving away a brand new Adidas Profeer the moment we hit 10,000 subscribers. Subscribe now. Commonwealth, a sneaker store over at Greenbelt, is packing so much heat because they have a lot of really nice shoes that dropped over the last few days. And I decided to drop by the store and check out all the different new shoes that were there from the different brands and then I ended up buying a few pairs myself and I'll get to that in a bit. So let's go through what I saw over at the store. Very quickly, this is not sponsored in any way. Actually, this channel is not sponsored in any way because most of the shoes, if not like 100% of the shoes that I feature here, are all bought by myself and it's something that I'm very happy of and I'm very proud. Let's start with the Air Maxes. So there were three really nice Air Maxes that dropped over at Commonwealth. Two of which originally dropped already in a different sneaker store, but there was a really nice one that I ended up buying which wasn't available yet in any other store. And that, of course, is the Air Max 98 Snakeskin. It's a really clean shoe, really nice, has suede, the brown, the whites, 3M strip all over it, really, really nice. One of the shoes that I copped in this particular trip. Highly suggest you guys check the out, this out if you are looking for a new Air Max 98s. Apart from the snakeskin, there were two already familiar shoes that you probably saw in different stores. It was a triple white Air Max 97. Really clean, really nice looking, uh, straightforward, fresh, and just timeless. Probably a dirt magnet, but it's probably something that you might want to have if you don't have a fashion-forward, stylish white shoe yet. Also, we were able to find out, we were also we were able to check out the Air Max 98 South Beach, all in its green glory, green and pink glory. So if you guys haven't seen that yet, or if you ran out of sizes when you were checking out in other stores, you might want to hit up Commonwealth and check if you still have, if they still have your size. Apart from the Air Maxes, the new Ver Nike Air Vapor Max 2s, Flyknits also dropped. There was one with the typical lacing system, color black. I think it was more on the blue and the green colorway, but it's your typical uh, Vapor Max 2. If I were to compare it to the original Vapor Max, which I which I already did the review on, and I'll put the link down below. I felt that the the Flyknit was a little more, uh, I don't know, snug, uh, and the. The middle part of the shoe is a little more wider. I don't know if they expanded the, the air bubbles at the bottom, but it's much better now for people with wide feet like me. So yeah, that model, and there was also a model without the laces. I don't know what it's called. It was primarily in pink uh, with the giant Air Max on both sides written on the tongue. Really cool shoe. Was thinking of getting it, but this was a little too out of my comfort zone when it came to the color, so I ended up passing on it. My friend though, Colin, was able to check it out, did a quick on feet, and he almost bought it, if not for the shoe that we saw next. The Oyster collaboration with Adidas, and they came in four colors. There was the red one the yellow one the blue one and the brown one Colin ended up copying the brown one I ended up getting something a little more different from my typical shoes I usually buy actually the safe colors like the browns and the blacks I ended up getting the red Adidas 350 Oyster really nice excited to wear this one probably wear it next week love the color love the build love the comfort on the shoe so if you guys are looking for sneakers like this one might want to check out again commonwealth four new colors of the adidas oyster for the women watching this video or for the men who are looking to give their wives their girlfriends or their partners something for uh you know like a makeup gift or just a gift in general the adidas arkin dropped today as well they were came in three colors white one a blue one and the dominantly brown one i ended up getting one for the wife of course the wife was with me uh, she loved the blue one primarily because it was the shoe that kendall jenner wore so when i when she when it was mentioned that kendall jenner uh, was the one who wore it and endorsed it her eyes lit up and she ended up uh, getting the blue pair so uh, it's a really nice shoe uh, from what she told me it was far more comfortable than your typical nmds so it's probably something that you might want to get your girlfriend your wife your partner or if you're a girl yourself you might want to check it out it's a really nice shoe really clean design and it'll probably help you stand out uh, amidst all the other nmd wearers out there today now those were the newer the newest releases but of course there were other sneakers that were there that are sitting that are still considered new and i highly recommend if you guys are looking for something edgy you might want to check out the color alpha bounce set they still have it in the three colors they were there on display i did a review on the white one i'll put the link down below 
check it out if you guys haven't watched it yet. They also had the Iniki Runner or the i59 something something uh, Pride of the 70s, which I also did a review on. I'll put it in the link down below. You guys might want to check that out if you haven't uh, been able to find your size. They probably still have it over at Commonwealth. Make sure you drop by the store and check, just get a feel for the different shoes that are there and buy the one that talks to you and buy the one that makes you feel comfortable with it when you're when you're on feet with them, obviously. And that's actually it for this vlog. It's a really quick sne sneaker shopping video. As I mentioned earlier, I ended up copying two pairs. I got the Nike Air Max 98 snake skin, really good buy. And of course, the Adidas 350 Oyster in red, which is something that I really love and I really look forward to wearing. Both of them actually look forward to wearing. Actually, I, I have a problem now. I have so many shoes that I can't wear the, the previously bought ones that were really nice and I really enjoyed because I have a long queue of shoes that I bought that I haven't even worn yet that are up for review. So the really nice ones that I want to wear regularly like the, the, the Nike Air Force, Air Force Air Max 270 Flyknits, the one in blacks, so I love that shoe, I can't wear it. The NMDs that I bought, like the, you know, the Invincible Neighborhood collab, I haven't worn it in a while. From the Yeezys to the Ultra Boost, wow. <laughs> you guys get the point. So, my, I, I guess what I'm trying to say is there's a lot more sneaker reviews coming up. A lot more content coming up. There's a long line of sneakers that I'll be doing videos on over the next few days. So please do make sure that you hit that subscribe button. That's it for now. If you guys are in the area, make sure that you hit Commonwealth over the weekend to check out all the new releases, all the new drops. I'm sure you'll love just checking them out and trying them on feet. I hope you guys have a great weekend. Have a great week next week. God bless. Peace. Subscribe. Shout out to George, the really cool dude over at Commonwealth. I think he's a store manager, really nice guy to talk to. If you guys see him, tell him that I told you to give him a shout out. Peace.